And I'm trying to read. Remember the recap. The 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 guardsman resistance was taking you to the leader died. I think he fell on a trap and got incinerated. So all that's <laughs> left is the rest of the guardsmen and the resistance fighters, plus yeah. the the uh, what's that? Fight. What's that guy that's with you, Ty, uh, Lieutenant? Not, yeah, Lieutenant. He's with you guys. That's. I don't remember his freaking name. It's been a whole year. Lieutenant Dingleberry. Let me no, see if the sticky notes transfer. Thorian Calix. <laughs> Lieutenant. Lieutenant Dan. <laughs> yeah, well, Thorian Car Yeah, I think it's Thorian Calix. Dor uh, Thorian Calix. Yep, Lieutenant yeah. First Class. Okay. And. Oh, Lord, sticky notes. Sweet. I didn't know if they would transfer over to the, my computer from my desktop, though. They do. And you guys are just getting into combat. If I remember correctly, you guys killed a squad, and there's some additional forces. Yeah, I was we getting shot at. We got to roll for initiative. You already did, just incorrectly. Oh. No, you just forgot to do it with kindness. So, uh, kindness? Ten what's that? I don't know. Something that people do. So, yeah, here's Couldn't the be order. me. I don't that exists. <laughs> yeah, that's wrong because he didn't. He, I have the thing where I double my initiative bonus. And then I guess re-roll. I'm going to delete everyone. Triple up. your initiative bonus with my ability thing active. Oh, that's right. Because we've got the unnatural. All right. It did not work. All right, that worked. Add twice the uh, character's agility bonus if the character has a natural, then add one to the multiplier. A four factor bonus. So this would be seven. Uh, which one did you? Nope, that's not it. How the fuck? Where the fuck is the button for this? Huh. Where'd my character sheet go? It got up and walked away. Where's the button for initiative? Hi. I remember there was one. Uh, uh, I think we were doing a... Uh... It's under attributes and abilities. And it's an additional right, thing. Right, it's a macro. It's yeah, a it's macro. a macro. That's right. What is your name? What is your favorite color? This is right. I gotta do. What? Okay, cool. I need to do. How the fuck do I manually calculate this shit then again? Because that's. Because I gotta, I gotta figure out how to calculate lightning reflexes into it. Because he's giving me. All right, whatever it's it is. a D10. Plus your agility bonus. Plus. Okay, that's the standard initiative. So if you're doubling your initiative bonus. I already have thing, lightning you... reflexes, so is that triple? Yeah. Yes, it's yes. triple. So you would add 18 onto your d10 roll? Jesus fucking Christ. Yes. There we go. Oh my jeez. That's some initiative right there. So my minimum initiative would be 19 from that one. Good God. Wait, what? <laughs> the light <laughs> lightning <laughs> reflexes add twice the character's agility bonus when rolling for initiative. Plus, he's already <laughs> done it. No, I got all that. I accidentally added a uh, oh. a light to the turn order. I don't know if you guys saw that. I'm trying to add you, oh, but there's there's a light. light. Yeah, I see a light source on that. Yeah, I see a light source. Yeah. 
I see a torch. What does this <laughs> what does this have to do with everything? Oh, torch here, strange. torch here, torch also, here. Oh, that's I crazy. Okay. I Hang on. I think you gotta put them on a different layer. Yeah, I think you're right. That sucks. You know, one would think you put a light thing down, it would automatically do it. No, we get to see it instead. Right, you're like, oh, these torches, that's so useful. Thank you. Yoink. Yeah, what is this, Minecraft? And fucking get your fucking torches out of here. Right, let me put down the light layer. Goodness gracious, alive. It's only the bridge person you say that, Cobra. You what? Nothing. What? Bad joke. You said he loves you. Oh. Yeah. Wait, what? I love you to... too, Moth, but purely platonically. I am devastated internally. <laughs> <laughs> you guys see a bunch of lights come on. Boss music ensues. You said that, and I heard a huge bass just now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm that good. I have skills with a Z. All right, don't forget, everybody, that we all get plus 10 to our weapon skill and ballistic skill when fighting corn. Corn? Oh, damn. Corn. Oh, man. Where are we going to find On a the field cob, in this space station? Not followers of corn, but just corn on the cob. Uh, everything is on the cob. Called? It gets stuck in the grill of my helmet. God, it's is very annoying. World? <laughs> Aerial. Cob world. Cob, other do, other day. Yes, everything's on the cob. The guns are on the cob. <laughs> the bullets <laughs> are on the cob. Um... <laughs> well, once my turn happens, their guns will be on the cob. The corn oh, followers are each on the cob. Resora, you've got the second highest uh, uh, fucking initiative, right? Yep. Perfect, because I'm going to put you where that purple line is. Me. Is that close enough? I have a sniper rifle. 200 meters is close enough. <laughs> when did you get a sniper rifle? This mission? A while ago. Before oh, the mission the started. Pistols. Oh. Yeah, I, technically I've got... Let's see. I've got two bolters, two melta pistols, two giant There's revolvers shit. that I can't use, and... <laughs> um, <laughs> What the shit? <laughs> and a sniper rifle and a matching pistol. Yeah, she's been walking around Whatever like a first person shooter. <laughs> yep. I didn't know this. It That's why my limit hurts so damn much. Oh, God. Uh, there's headlights. He's the actual Doom guy. They have a surge flight. It's blinding us. You said vortex grenade? Thank God our visors have an auto dimming feature. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> I just want you to know the first time this character ever took damage, and I lost a foot. That's well, why I hiding, have so many guns. You're hiding. I behind need to kill me. everything before it kills me. <laughs> just don't die. Get good. Yeah, it's easy. Just don't die. I've been good. I've been dodging every hit. Yeah, you have. Except for that yet. last one. Keep doing that. Okay, real quick, is there a wall here? Yes. Yep. Okay, because I can't see, like... And it's like yeah. a half, a half door. Mm -hmm. It's like a half open door thing. Yeah, there's... Okay, so, yeah, because I couldn't see to, like, here, and then I could see. I was like, what the fuck? Yeah. It's like, why... Yeah. It's also why I'm taking cover with that uh, area. Ah, well, I'm about to make some cover. Uh. <laughs> it's called me. Just remember, there's a trap right in front of you. Uh, I have. Yeah, by the way, there are four people in here. I have planned out a path of movement that takes me around these traps. Hey. Uh... Hey, by the way, the turn order is fucked for me. Oh, that's there you go. Yeah, there go. Um, go. Okay. Ah, uh, hang on. He stumbles up like a giant lumbering oaf to here. And... And that's your turn. You ran. <laughs> no, I did not. That's a move. Half action or full action? 
That's a full action. Yeah. So that's your turn. <laughs> Okay, so next. Unless, I can sh unless that turret can shoot. Sorry, for sorry, oh, go. That's right. Does your turret have its Isn't own your thing? Turret a your yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, turret. Okay. Yeah, that's I was cool. like, wait a minute, did something change? I was like, uh, uh, no, uh, turret, yes. turret, do its own thing. So just click the turret. Okay. Cool, cool. Uh, and I, I just have. I, I think I have to type this in. Yeah, I, I think it's an item on your thing. Yeah, it's on the shield. How many it times hits. does this thing fire? Uh, I don't remember how many times it fires. Full auto, so oh, fires ten. that full. Yeah, fires. No, it depends on your degree of success, actually. So that would be six. Yeah, six. Eins, zwei, drei, vier, five, six. That's six of them. And where does that hit? I can. Well, I know for my attacks, I can make them all hit. Thirty-four. I don't the actually chest? know. If that I don't oh, know if I can. They might be able to they, they, Center they got, chest. They might be able to absorb that because they have. Oh no, they they can't absorb that. They they have twenty armor on the chest. Oh, so these aren't the super elite gunners then. Good. Yeah, these are the glass cannon guys. These are the glass cannon guys. You not remember? You guys weren't. You guys are not fighting that. Well, the glass cannons had the swords, but you're using the models with the guns. Which every time we fought the ones with the guns, usually had outrageous chest armor. Uh, even the even these guys, I made glass cannons too. Oh, oh okay. I made it balanced. You guys were fighting nothing but tanky people. It's like you know, what? I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna give it to them and let them fight. Not tanky people, but they're gonna hurt like the Dickens when they do hit. Uh, so, so I've got precisely which is how no, Neil Tyson got right. obliterated. Right, and yeah, the the turret is its own thing. You just fire yeah. it. Um, <clears throat> so pin five fifteen. So minus four on the first guy, so minus four. And then so anything past fifteen will hit. So I'll just do that. So one oh. that he absorbs it. Got another minus one. So one, two, three, four, five of them would hit. That's one. Yeah, they all they all hit. And then oh the last one might be really, really good. Um let's see. 23 minus 15. My brain can't compute right now. Minus eight. He is nearly dead. He is fucked up. <laughs> For Sora, go. Right. And you turn to hit this guy here. I'll, I'll put a the guy that's hurt. I don't, I don't know which one's hurt was aiming at. I'm presuming it was the closest. Yeah. And the, by the way, the guys with the arm flexing, they're the ranged boulder guys. Mm. So, I made them distinguishable. Besora, for your clarification, the shield is also still very much planted and, and firm if you're using it for cover. Alrighty. I don't know where the fuck you're hanging out on me, so. Also, boulder, I guess, for the moment. Uh, let's see. I want to do, you can do a will save here real quick for you to turn. Go to. So minus that, we'll save. Minus 19. Mm -hmm. So hang on. I've got a plus 30 Wait. to my will saves from being a keeper. Wait, is that for uh, psychic powers or anything like that? Mind control? It's from the suit, yeah. It'd be mind. Mind control. Because, yeah, I've got a plus 30 to that. Okay. There you go. You probably just ignore it then. Uh, so, overall, you've, they, he put wards on the suit. I remember last time, which was a plus mm -hmm. 30. And then I've got Oathbound, which is plus 30 to mind control. So, that's plus 60 minus 19. Ah. 19. Uh, hang on. i got to do math because I can't figure out what that is off the top of my head. But who knows? You may royally mess up and get a hundred. Oh, I could absolutely, yeah. Like you still technically succeed, but something bad happened. Oh yeah, no. There you go. Yeah. Um, okay, Prasar, go. There you go. 
Ooh. Who are you hitting? Uh, yes. Yes. <laughs> Probably the ranged guys. Uh, we'll start from the top and then work our way down. I say these two here are ranged, and that yeah, I how guess many hits the... is that. Okay, I haven't used these in a while. Bolters were four max, so eight and eight. Oh, that's right. I have the melter. Uh, yep. You're gonna have fun. You, <laughs> fucked, you fucked up some dreadnoughts with that earlier, I think. I think one dreadnought. Uh um, he didn't go down. What no. is their torso armor again? Twenty. Uh, these guys are chaos. I forget. Sanctified weapons do what against these guys again? Again? What do sanctified weapons do against them again? Doubles the damage. Ah. That's what we agreed to. That's a lot of damage. So the first, guy, the first guy's dead. He only had three health. And that's what, 11 that got through, and then the next one, that's eight. Yeah, this is a sanctified weapon, so. Oh, so minus 16. That's already factoring in their armor, I might add. Yeah, I know. Armor like, target, 20. Minus, tw minus 20. Yeah. Okay, this guy's dead. And then... <laughs> Oh, I see. okay. I that see blue honey. ring, those ah, those rings are. Oh my god! <laughs> Why are they outlined? <laughs> I don't I know. <laughs> I'll just delete them. They're dead. All right, cool. Yeah, the those are dead. No, the men are dead. I just didn't want to deal with the damn rings anymore because, like, I I kept trying to undo. I couldn't undo because apparently someone else did it. So I'm like, whatever. I don't care no more. <laughs> They're dead. You killed them. 66 will kill all all four of them. Or actually, one would be still up, but he might as well just be dead. I it, I had a second gun ready to fire anyway, so. I'll fire it. Let's just all say right. he lived. It's like I always bring a token back. Oh, I warmed up the mouse bomb for nothing. Mm, mustache. Or multi mantles. And the last guy takes negative, negative 184. 184 oh, I put 50 instead of uh, 20. Whoops. <laughs> Subtract 30. Stay. Add 30 to all those damage rolls. Your, That's... your attack healed him back to life. <laughs> That's a <laughs> lot of <laughs> damage. Holy free holy. No, I, I put Wait. the wrong armor on. Oh, okay, yeah, armor. It was supposed to be 20, point. not 50. Yeah. So add 30 <laughs> to everything, and then you get the right numbers. Uh, By the way, there, it, would, there one is... One of those would never... Why can I draw? Oh, they changed it. What? It is a new year. I want to do freehand draw. Why? Freehand. Can I throw a rock at the light? I can still freehand draw. What are you talking well, about? Well, as you're looking at the light, you see there's a giant gun attached to it. Oh, fuck. That would have been useful information to get, I don't know, before? Uh, you guys just saw a light. You guys didn't look up until just now. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean we didn't look up? <laughs> You didn't we look just... at it. You didn't ask. No one asked about it. You saw a light. Oh, really light. They have a spotlight. You guys made an assumption like, okay, well, that's what the characters make. That's the assumption they make. The spotlight. Can... And as, you, as can... your character looks up, you see a giant cannon attached to it coming from the ceiling. Yeah, can we take a moment to appreciate that giant, horribly drawn Pistol? handgun? Yeah, that's pretty hilarious. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> I think it's pretty good, guys. 
Um, Sorry. I'm. Is it my turn yet? Is it a miniature space? Bar it is a miniature space. Bar I think it's my turn. Uh, uh Prasora went and Velo go. All right. Uh, I'm going to try and shoot the light out. His name is Rookatil. Yeah. Yeah, Virlo. Rookatil. Yeah. That's his last name. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm going to try and shoot this stupid light out on this gun. Okay. Minus uh, 60. Minus 60. Damn. All right. What about uh, shooting the gun? Or just closing the door. <laughs> but if I shoot the light out, then it won't be able to see us. Wait, where, what about closing or the door? Or we won't be able to see it. Well, uh, due to intelligence check, I guess. Your characters might know. Our characters might know what an automatic machine gun comes to see. <laughs> I don't know what the light is. The light is, because your character's trying to take a shot at it, so obviously he's getting the dumbs. I got it's a like, one oh! Person. Is this, is a, this is intelligence. Yeah, just this intelligence is, checks or a lore. Just intelligence. You can do intelligence checks because it'd be common knowledge to space marines. What this, what this is, it's just a big giant tactical like the blind enemies, because it's pulse, it's pulsing as well. So it's trying, like your guardsmen are holding their hands up, but oh. you have visors, like you said, so it doesn't affect you. You just notice it's doing something. <laughs> it's it doing it. something. Did it say? Oh, it's shooting at us. Oh no, not yet. Uh, so Vila, what else are you doing? You gonna move? Or are you just gonna like you took a shot at it? I took a shot at it, and, and I bounced back right off its cover. armor. Yep. Boop. We made our intelligence checks. Yeah, you you know what it? I mean, uh, I I meant him to do it. You guys didn't need to do it. Oh. Just him, because your characters assumed. Oh, that's a probably a tactical light. His character actually shot at the thing. Like your character should do the intelligence check. All right, uh, Karnoff, go. Uh, so this is a door, I presume. What is this in front of us? It's barricades. You see, bar a lot of barricades. All right. And the door right does not. Here. Yeah, the door does not look operational. It's like they. Uh, rip the door apart and use the parts from that to make these fortifications. They put a wedge right. right in the bottom of the door to keep it open, and it just got stuck. Yeah. So do I notice the gun hanging from the ceiling then? Well, I mean, Tyron can literally just... That's a free action gun and the voice comm. So I'm Tyron is right dead. Now. Not Tyron. Um, <laughs> yeah, hard. I was boxed that there was a searchlight, not that there was a feckin' turret. Well, your character right. just noticed it now, and as soon as you said, uh, asked what it was, so your character would have looked up. Reaction. It's a feckin' turret. Yeah, so you can you can relay that information instantaneously. Hey, all right, fucking gun up here. Right. I jump up and I try to squash it uh, with a uh, giant hunger hunger steel as my sword. Uh, minus. 60. Why not just turn it around? Right, minus sixty. Okay, uh, that's gonna be minus. 25. I still hit. Okay. The other damage. And you're flying all the way to the ceiling to hit this thing, by the way. So you're going to be falling yes. back down. Okay. I'll pour these corridors. Here's a jetpack. You'll be fine. Uh, how many? Do we know, like, uh, what's the armor? It's, it's the a high city. city. Huh? It's going to be 50. Ar 50 armor. Okay. Three damage, yeah. You scratch it. <sighs> and are you landing behind the turret or in front of the turret? I am landing behind. I'm doing a moving uh, like forward cut, so I just passing by the turret and landing behind it. All right. And your character, you want to do an intelligence check, you can probably relay information what this thing is, or lore check. I already did one, but I can do one again. Uh... Yeah, he made an intelligence check with me. Yeah, you discerned it was a turret, but he got a little closer. I was going to give you a turret. Yeah, I was going to give you a plus 60, but sure. 
Oh, okay. <laughs> so you would succeed, so your character would know this is more than likely an auto cannon turret, so you don't want to be in front of this thing. I relay that information. Okay, it is their turn. So let's see. What's the rate of fire? Okay. Uh let's see. Who's here? Karn. Heraclades. I'm gonna do a one D three. It's gonna hit either Crom. Actually, one D four, because uh you're Brasora on his shoulder, right? Yes. Uh Brasora, where on me are you? I have no idea. Uh here? I think Brasora should be like mostly covered okay. by me. Uh, one is Karen, two is Moth, three is the Lieutenant, and four is, uh, Yelmug there. The Lieutenant. Alright, okay. Poor Lieutenant. He's... <laughs> Isn't he directly covered by me from line can't, of sight? Can't he do a dodge? And the turret is way above you. It has a good angle on all of you guys. He can dodge. I don't know if he can dodge all of it. <laughs> He's so He's dead. Half, half, <laughs> half rage. <laughs> that hits. Uh oh. And that's what? One, two, three, four. Good God. Is this automatic? Yes. One auto one. cannon. Oh, one more? Yeah, it's every degree of success plus <laughs> zero. What? He's zero maybe... plus every degree of success. Yeah, he's going to try to dodge. Uh. But this might be the end of this guy. <laughs> I think he can only dodge one round anyway, so... No, but he can dodge... Uh, oh, that's true. He, so. he can only dodge one instance of damage. <laughs> He's dead. Oh, wait, no. Automatic fire. If it's automatic <laughs> fire, he can dodge multiple of them. I yeah. Think. yeah. If he works. succeeds, he, the he number... Would, if, if his... the oh, oh. He would dodge the attack, so if he meets a beats, 4.6, right? Yeah. Meets beats. Beats, I think. I think it was well, every degree of success. No. He dodges a damage. Meets. No, yeah, it, it ev meets. every degree of success, he dodges an extra meter past his agility bonus. Okay. And so if, if, if he were to dodge backwards behind cover, he probably shouldn't get hit. Oh, or he, he is. dodged forwards into me. So he succeeded. But, of he course, Boko's going to do a minus 100 to his dodge roll. No, it wasn't minus 100. Yeah, I know. Can we spare? Can I spare a fate point? Yeah. I have you want to reroll that dodge check? You want a sure. fate point to not kill them, BC? Okay. Hey, he's a good first. NPC. So we'll go give him twenty. Say. There you go. He dodged out of oh, the way. Oh damn! He dodged into cover. <laughs> good loot in it. Uh, I'm going to take this moment to indicate the orange path that I've highlighted and send it to everyone's visor. Right. <clears throat> to that Move that fucking way now. Yeah, you just see it plap plap that ground where the lieutenant was, and there's just giant craters. The lieutenant Dan survived? Yeah, he lieutenant dodged out of the way. Okay. Like, there's giant effing craters in the floor <laughs> where that thing shot. Doos, doos, doos. That's all you guys hear is rapid fire of that. Like, what the... Alright, Dominagus, go. Okay. Fire at the turrets with the okay. multi-melter. Minus 60. Minus 60? Uh-huh. The fuck? Aren't we all targeting it now? Yeah. So I have... Ba is it chaos? It's chaos. All yeah, it's right. a chaos. It's a chaos-infused weapon. You see a bunch of heretical symbols on it. Then I have plus 10 chaos, plus 20 for my attachments, so 30 in total. It's not half range, and I, didn't, I did not apply the weapon skill to him. And it's armor's 50, so we got punched to that. Give me a second. <laughs> didn't we bring something that like adds to everyone's aiming if they're all aiming at something? So, uh, uh, I don't, I don't know. What, what so then it will be minus Probably thirty. Do. Yeah, we do. It's gonna. Uh, we've got a sigium. All right. Yeah, a sigium. You have to I, use it. I have to. I have to pull it up and remember what it was. 
Uh, Virla was attacking it. I was attacking it. So that's plus 20 to the thing. You hit it. Do you uh, damage? No, that's what it was. Yeah, if someone could see it, everyone would have gotten a plus 20. That's the, that's the Seguum. It, instead of having to all gang up on it, it automatically applies it. Okay. And what kind of weapon is this? Energy. It's Energy a melter. Melter. It's a melter cannon. Okay, it's destroyed. Page 174. Core. Don't worry, guys. I still have 84 rounds with this thing. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <I> get... <laughs> before you have to reload. I've got 80 before I have to reload mine. No, I have a backpack, so that's all I have is 84 rounds. Oh. I... You can reload it. Yep. It, it Ooh, went, yeah, that um... just puts 100 rounds in the magazine. And as so you, you see the turret fall, I need uh, Karnoth to do a dodge check here. How does it reload if it's it, a backpack? It doesn't. Here? That's the backpack. It doesn't reload. Yeah, so you would have a little oh. box of like 50 on the side, or you've just got a, a feeder so they can just hot top you. You don't have to worry about swapping it. I didn't say reload. I only have 84 rounds left, period. Oh, and I oh, forgot. Okay, I bring more than the backpack. Do a dodge check because you also went right into a trap, too. Did I? Not you, Karnoth. As, as he landed, there's, okay. there's a trap there. All right. Is what that why there's rounds? a mini Space Marine Corps? <laughs> yeah, it's a tiny baby it's space shrunk. marine. No, it's like I the was shrunk and trap. you will be too. <laughs> Dude, what caliber uh, is your weapon? Hmm? What caliber? It's a uh, multi melta, so it'll be energy. There's no. There's, there's a trap there. I didn't know what you had. It's always a caliber. I did have heavy bolter. Uh, I say, yeah, there's no way someone didn't bring a canister or two for you, so. Mm. Oh, wait, no, it's just a power pack, so it just uses universal it's... power cells. You're fine. Yep. Yeah, then we've all got power cells. Oh, okay. Yeah, because the lamp packs use the exact can, use the exact same. Mm. You're good. So theoretically, I could just take your energy. I succeeded yeah. on my dodge uh, check, cells. by the way. Yeah, that's all. That's all. So. Well, that's good to know. I just find it funny I only used 16 shots so far in this mission. Yep. It makes uh, feel better. I fired 20. To say no, Karnov, <laughs> as you're landing and you dodge and all that, you hear your giant footsteps coming emanating from this direction. I like the sounds of that. Mm -hmm. Which direction? Uh, um, I would like to use the... <laughs> I'm going to roll... I want to... Uh, I'm highlighting it now. In fact, I could probably focus ping. Yes, you could. please. Now is a good time to do that. So, this direction. What direction? Nothing's out. Yes. Not focus. You not see that? Oh no! no. no. I got be. I got be in token later. Okay. Now, what about now? Yes. Okay. Cool. Cool. Now, so, are we going right or left? That's left. No, that's no, no. no. The... I was asking them. Are we going oh. right or left? I'm just along for the ride at this point. Where were we hiding? Anyway? Who the fuck's guiding us? I have, I genuinely have no clue. So <laughs> it's been a year. Where are we going, Voidsman? Where are we going? So you're asking the lieutenant. Uh, I am purposely calling him a Voidsman and asking him where are we going. Ah, uh, he said that's uh, the resistance know where the, uh, where we're going, and the leader has since been you know killed by traps. So uh, he knows generally where the elevator is at. And he points you in a direction, which is the left. The left Up direction. here? No, not that way. He says it's Down kind here? of this way. You mean straight? West. Where the noise is coming from. Yeah, west. Right where the noise is coming from. He says generally it's in that direction. From his understanding and his intel. Okay, so we should has... be going down here then. We can. Before I step forward in that direction, I'd Teach like to... Auspects. Make a awareness check to see any traps. I would All like right. to use the siege aspects at the same time. Alright, I'm gonna turn turn her off since we're going to be moving. I'm just going to scan the ground for a siege aspects because it should show up with that. Oh clear. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep. Okay, <laughs> uh no, no issues. Do a dodge check, minus sixty. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going I would <laughs> Jesus Christ. Can I please search with the siege aspects, the ground in front of us? <gasps> oh my god! Wow. 
You, do, you dodged it? Cool. Otherwise, I you dodged been, it. You have been hit by that. Oh my. Jesus. Oh, can, can I take that? You just see a giant, like, explosion where you were. And just mm -hmm. melt the ground. And you look up and you see... Uh, it was just a, like, melted charged and some other... I don't know, you're not sure how they constructed it, but it blasted right on the ground. Like oh, a, the like, cannon? It is like a cannon. No, uh, say, is that the cannon exploding? No, the cannon already destroyed. No, this, this is the trap that uh, Karnoth just set off. Oh, oh Mark. Yeah, he just marked it. He's like, yep, all good. And he literally moved his character right on a trap, which is right here. Fire oh, to lovely. Fire to the GA overlay. <laughs> yeah, if I were to show you the GA overlay, he's literally right perfectly in the middle of it. That's what's hilarious. Perfect. Uh, oh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, like, oh. <laughs> Go ahead. I would like to use the Siege Jaw specs to actually look for traps real quick. Okay. Um, um, plus... Plus 30 as you're looking for traps, then. Uh, what do you want me to use? Awareness? Oops. Perception? Awareness? You're just using your C DOS specs. I do want to investigate that cannon to see if I can take it. 6.4. <laughs> okay. And your uh, C DOS specs, I'm going to mark. I think. Yeah. Uh, 20 meters through difficult walls, and I think it's like 100 meters or whatever for difficult. I can look it up again. It's page. I'll tell you exactly yeah. the page. Do 100 is. meters. Like, uh, 100 meters, which means yeah. I can see the end of this. And then I can see uh, going off of me. I should yeah, just do like, all yeah, here. Just, yep, just go ahead. 100 meters down where you want to see, and I'll unveil. I mean, I'm first scanning all the way down here. I don't know if you can see directly where, I'm look, where I've got my thing. Okay. I can see the far wall. You Okay. That's 100 meters. I'm gonna move your character over there. So, oh, you're going to? Oh no, I was, I'm scanning with it. Like I can see. Yeah, you're just seeing through all the stuff. So this is what you can see. So there is actually two turrets up above. If you're looking for that, two turrets up above of the same one you just encountered. A uh, up here. Yeah, and then you see a dreadnought coming down. Oh, that's. Awesome. That's exactly what I wanted to see. I would like to use the machine curse on him. Really? It was... So, provided, of course, I get my willpower check off. <laughs> and you can do that with that line. You can do that. You can use use Chrom's line of sight to do it. If he's directly in front of... Oh, I see. Uh, well, I'm using the siege aspects to scan, and I'm gonna I'm sending that info to you. So you'll see... Gotcha. A big, okay. you'll I thought see he had walked like, in the line of sight or something. No, no, okay. No, so no, no. you're seeing yeah. two big hot spots, which I've marked this as turrets, I'm presuming. I'm I'm, like, so I'm imagining looking through the uh, dreadnought will, will look kind of like a dreadnought, big and boxy. So I've made a big boxy thing here for him. The turrets should look kind of like turrets, so I'm marking them. Are yep. there any other traps or anything that I'm seeing? See two two cannon turrets, and I'll. I got I'll those move marked. Them. Yeah, I'll move them where they're supposed to be. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Cool. I didn't know exactly where. So. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. So we've got two turrets there. Uh, any other ground traps? You don't see any. Okay. Um, and this then looks like a, this looks like a fortified position. So if I'm do do do, where was I? Like right here. Do I see anything scanning here? Uh, let me get. I'm hot. I highlighted the traps. Uh, the but just go ahead. Uh, draw where you want to see traps, and I'll highlight them. Uh, I'm scanning. I can should be able to see in a flat line about here. All right, and I, I mark the material see. between me. Yep, I can see enough. I marked where the traps were. So you cool. should see three, whatever. Okay. Yeah, I can see this. Okay. Uh, I'm sending all that information to everyone else's visor. Do you see a path around it? I say, seal this front door, go left. Or at the very least, we can cut left and set up a defensive line. Very well, then. We should do just that. Yeah. To I that, try to find a button to close the door. You push the button, you hear nothing. Can we Amazing. Really close it? Like he's put, he's click, 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 click. Doesn't work. The door so button appears to be broken. Oh, it's it's like, we need it. 
is the door still there in like the slot and like the door? Uh, it looks like they they removed that door. All right. Cool. In which case, uh, you guys, how do you guys feel about pounding all the way down here? We'll pull out the siege right before we get there and keep scanning as we go. I like pounding. Cool. Uh, oh, <laughs> I see it now. So now I'm gonna use my power. Everyone. <laughs> yeah. Are we? Get, get the soft squishies in here now. Like the moment I see it pop its ugly head around that corner. Get the squishies down this corridor now. But guide them around the traps. I'm using my power. Go for it. I'm gonna guide them around the traps, I guess. Um, yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm gonna ooh. and goofball. I'm sure you've been waiting for this. First time I've been able to use it, so yes. <laughs> So what does it do again? All right, so, uh, and I did it un unfettered. Uh, it's not double, so I don't have to run the chart. Uh, so now that Dreadnought uh, cannot move or fire for eight rounds. Oh, perfect. Oh, so I can just use the multi multi Yep. Okay. Uh, while he's doing that, I am scanning down this corridor. I can see to that purple line from where I'm currently standing. Okay, I'm putting eight turns on it. All right, kill the dreadnought, burn it to death. Firing. I've stopped do its I, movements. Do I want? Do, uh, should I? Uh, should I just fire at? Uh, should I just do hit and then see if I can hit it, or and then just do it normally? Yes. I mean, you still have to be able to hit the broadside of a barn to hit a broadside of a barn. <laughs> eh, true. Yeah, he's also it. huge, so he's like plus two. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, you'll have an easier time hitting it, but you still got to hit it. Why does the dreadnought look like the late Captain Malakius? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, so who's up front up there? Leading the. I'm gonna uh, start firing at. I'm you, gonna start okay. firing at the multi melto. So. I mean, with the multi melto. I haven't with scanned the, past there, so don't go past. I there. I thought right. I said with, but I'm you said at. All right. <laughs> I'm waiting oh. for Coco to give me the results for the Siege Aspect scan down there. Alright. I shoot at the multi-melta with the multi-melta. <laughs> we set the multi-melta down and we start shooting at it with pistols. <laughs> Hopefully it shooting. doesn't explode. I start yeah. shooting the is... with the multi-melta. Is there any modifiers, Boku? Uh, just your plus 20 and then if you're half, half range and if you any of... That targeting thing that uh, Darren has. Well, how much does it give you bonus wise? Uh, well, the targeting that's that's, that's more than half. That's that's more than half range, so it's not half range. Well, that, that's what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. If you're half range, okay, it is a right. corn entity, so you get plus ten against yeah. it. Yeah, so it should be plus thirty, unless he's got anything else. I got a bit plus sixty base. Okay, oh, plus ten chaos, RDS, motion protector. So plus sixty. Uh, hey. hmm. I think it hits. I think you got your full full auto uh, out of that, <laughs> which is just two shots. Hey. Yep, you tickle it. But because like it's a multi melta, it, it degrades armor every time you hit. It does. Yes, it does. So he's burning that armor off. So, so it goes from a hundred to what is it? Seventy. So how many times can I shoot it? It's stunned for eight rounds. So you could shoot it eight ra times before it... So seven more times before it can do anything. Before if that, I get closer, I can also help with my other pistols. Real quick, yeah, before that, uh, do I see anything down to this purple line? Uh, down to the south? More contact, by the way. On yeah. the siege aspects? <laughs> there be people. I think of a void grenade would work here. It'll work on one person. I mean, if you hit it right here, it'll take out the doorway. In a, in a small area, yes. Yeah, because I see at least four contacts moving in. Sweet. How far oh, away is let me that? Get the, no, let's get the I trap can throw it. All kind of doing what, one big move all in one go. Yeah, I'm just moving as you guys are doing things. So that's, that's basically after he did his little shooting. You guys are starting to see guys coming to that area, so you can I've shoot been again. Asking about traps. Before that, I've been asking for like traps down to the purple line. Yeah, yeah. Give me a second. 
just because I, I got them going down there. Might want to stay in initiative to make sure everyone at least yeah. take their turns. Okay. Do you see? Yeah, I'll put it back up. <clears throat> okay, uh, okay so what are you going to do? Oh. Well, can I see that guy? I don't think I can yet. Can I? Uh, are you on my left shoulder, or my I'm right? I'm on one of them. So the shield's in my right hand. So more than likely, I'm guessing you're on my left. In which case, probably barely. Like the tip of his gun. <laughs> Fuck it, I'll shoot his gun. It's minus minus eighty on that. Oh, well. <laughs> it's a hell of a shot, bro. Firing it's a, a sniper rifle. Go for it. <laughs> you know how difficult it is to shoot someone's rifle? No one really targets someone's weapon, but go for oh. it. <laughs> Haven't you ever sure seen a western a movie? Target. <laughs> they shoot the it. guns out of each sure other's hands. Is a smaller target. Minus sixty, then take your shot. All right, what were my bonuses? To be fair, I could have moved down to like here if you needed me to. I just kind of hopped over the barricade. Nope, miss. And then. Just so you know, past this, you guys are going into the court area where there'll be uh, at least two knights. The the mechs. They have to deal, contend with, and deal with. It's gonna be fun, isn't it? Dan, did that door right there seem like it was operational? I did not check. Copy. So you're gonna check it. I mean, if he told if he tells me to go check it right now, I will. Okay. Depends um, on what, what he wants me to do. So real quick, group decision: keep pushing down left, seal the doors, and keep moving. If nothing else, create a funnel. Yeah, I uh, like that idea. Because if nothing else, there's two turrets there, so we're not going to be able to push. So anyone melee oriented is going to be at a disadvantage. Probably insta gibbed. I'd yeah. Take okay. One at a time. In which case, I would say, let's start pulling down left. Uh, I've seen Joss Bex up to here. Just check the doors as we go. If we can seal them, seal them. All right. Uh, how do I check doors? I'm right next to this one. Okay. You uh, click the button. You see that's slowly coming down. All right. I click it back again so it doesn't go down yet. Everyone should use the info. As you click it again, you just still, still see it slowly coming down. Oh, okay, God. Dead. Okay, move. Everyone move down there now. Okay. Oop. As we pass this door, I'll, I'll see if it can be sealed. Yeah, there's, as well. there's enough time for you guys to get everyone through if you guys run. Okay, so yeah, charge. I don't know, man. My character's real slow. How slow are you? It's gonna well, be five. for run speed, it's 48, so... Right, so five turns will be shut. Okay. Go ahead. Could, I map. should be able to make it. Yeah, map out five runs. All right, all right. At least two turns. Okay. Couldn't Crom, because he's fucking massive, just stand Crom under will... the door and prop it open? <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Can else can do that? He's that slow, I will throw you. Just, I would say start moving now. Slow people first. All right. So whoever this is, this <clears> one. <throat> we're still. Yeah. Lucien's going to. Here. Yeah, that's Heraclades, Dominguez, and Virlo. Or it's just Dylan. Oh, I thought we were doing all this in uh, turn order. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> all right. You don't have to, unless you want to engage. I only did that to... But yeah, go ahead. I mean, you, we can go in turn order. You're technically not in combat. I just want to make sure everyone... Yeah, right. Let's get, let's get going. Yeah, yeah, because you guys are moving. Okay, once I get further down, we'll see jaw specs again. So don't don't go past that line that I marked on the hood. Purple? Oh, yeah. this guy's still... Yeah, he's still derped. Keep the guardsmen from... Is that everyone? No one else is up there still? 
Correct. Okay. Uh, is there a button uh, operational there one on this? No. Because as far as as far as these guys are concerned, they didn't see what happened, so they're just funneling in to the explosions. Is there a is there a working button on this door? <clears throat> Except for this dreadnought who did see what happened is fucking stuck. And say again. Uh, I am checking the button on this door right here. Nothing happens as you click it. Is there still a door there? You look up, you see that is also torn out. Very well. Okay. It's Where like they tore out the doors and cobbled together a fortification in that that area up there. Okay. I'm going to move forward and I'm going to pass the siege aspects to uh, Dan so we can actually scan. Where the, where the shit is Dan? One of these things down here is Dan. I think this is him. No. Where is... Where the fuck are you? He's next to you. You oh, should be he? able to mouse over people and see their names. Oh, which no. Dan? The Lieutenant Dan or the player Dan? <laughs> <laughs> you goofball. <laughs> I, I have the, oh. I'm giving you the siege aspects so you can scan. It's, li it's sure. literally... A I was um, you're you're more up in front than I have been right now, so I'm letting you. All right, Boko, I time. have my character has like a red outline, but I don't think others can see it. Can you enable it on my token for others to see as well? Say that one more time. Uh, my token has a red outline, uh, which others cannot see. Can you enable it so that others can see that? Yes. Okay. Just so that you know like where the character is at. So you can distinguish better from the rest of the tokens. Also, hang on. You said they prepared that as a fortified area against sieges, yes? Not, not against sieges. It looks like they fortified it in a hastily against something. More than likely, you deduce it's you guys. Okay, can I use my ability of siege tactics to try and figure out the best way? Sure. Please be a good roll. Oh, Would come you like on. to fade oh, point that? <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, I will. Back the way he's like, no, back the way we came. Okay. Uh, it's not that low of a roll. That's not bad, all things considered. I don't, I don't want to question your uh, years of experience, brother, but I think you're wrong. <laughs> so you're, you're uh, just ever pass defense is a good offense. You're just ever oh, so slightly it. wrong. That, no, you're doubling down. No, it's That's back it. that way through the big group of people. Oh God. <laughs> Do you need another fate? It's a fifty-fifty roll for this. Oh, and uh, as you're doing this, also will save minus sixty. Right, because you have to resist yourself from going over there and fighting them. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> it freezes back through that way. He said, "What? What is it? Minus sixty. Oh, well then, it's just a. Oh boy, this is just a straight up. You you Ruh -ruh. immediately turn around and I your guys like to give him point. a fade point for that. Sure. Uh, but your guy does." Snap around and turn around. He's looking at that door. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you clench your fist and then you let it go. It passes. Oh, I might have fucked up. There's a plus 10 on that on that seed roll. Oh, okay. Uh, infused so knowledge. Sweet. Yeah, infused knowledge. So I didn't need to use a fate point for one of those. I I was like, I swear you, I you, had something. You get the fate point back, but it was a cool uh, role <laughs> no, play. I had thing. a stupid moment. So you, you guys like, okay, no, it's gonna be down this whole corridor. We we want to flank around these guys because more than likely they they protected their flanks with traps and put a majority of their forces in one location as a, basically a counter trap to you guys coming in. That sounds like a void grenade. Kind of like, yeah, but what you just witnessed is what was going to happen if had you charged forward, which would have been you would have been flanked on both sides and murdered. So, 
Yeah, I forgot to use my fucking insight and the fact that I had infused knowledge, and either one of those would have given me a plus that would have made that a a, a success. Right. So I just have, have to be stupid. I have yeah. foresight. Okay, yeah, I'm sure you're scanning for traps. Uh, Dan is. He has the siege aspects now. He's okay. uh, Is it just an awareness roll? Uh, yeah. yeah, it's a. It's got a hundred meter range, unfetted, and up to twenty meters through difficult, uh, like obstructions. All right. Uh, so let's. And you're see. looking down the hallway to the left. I am you looking down the hallway to the left. You could move yeah. up to here and then look down, yeah. so you don't have anything obstructing it. I've scanned yeah, up yeah, yeah. the purple marker. I just don't know for sure what all is in here. Oh. Looks like I can go through this wall. Yeah, I like. You can shoot up to a hundred meters down. Okay, and the, I'm gonna say that's off now. Did so, anyone get hit? No one got hit. The lieutenant almost got murdered. Oh, I guess it's more of a code. That no more, no more traps anymore. You don't see you can more scan traps. it. You can, yeah, you can you can swing that left and right. Yeah, you see no more traps in that direction. The ones I've highlighted is the one. Yep, that's what you okay. see. Okay, no turrets, no nothing showing up. All uh, right, nothing. Cool. I let that's everyone it. know. You want me to pull a rear guard? Uh, I think you should be actually you spearheading in the front. Me. You want me up front? <laughs> okay. Oh, hello. Is this a reactor? What what are we staring at? Uh, as you come in, it just looks like a weapons cache. Ooh, ooh, hang on. A lot let's of open up. Weapons. Let's open up all the loot boxes. Can I uh, can I do a search? I have searched. I am looking. See a lot. Can we keep corn? these guys from going in that corridor so that they don't encounter? Yeah, the... one, keep the guardsmen from messing with it, because if it is chaos touched, the symbol actually does have power. Yeah, they're all chaos. Every single weapon you see is chaos touched. Corn infused weaponry. You see I'm looking all specifically of it. for explosives. Uh, you see more of the, the cannon ammo for those melted cannons. The big ones? Where? Yeah. The... Where, is where it at? ammo yeah. or multi cannon itself? I'm looking for melted weapons. Ammo that okay. Um, yeah, so the ammo I can those cannons. Anyone here trained in explosives? <laughs> Our explosives uh, the one thing guy that we refused to died. Train. Note to self. <laughs> Actually, Lieutenant, how gets Lieutenant Dan at explosives? He's special ops. Yeah, does the NPC have a demolitions training? Yeah, I think they do. Because I know they carry explosives on their default loadout. It's just grenades, but... Yeah, you see a lot of crack grenades. <clears throat> no, 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 we're asking if uh, Lieutenant Dan has any explosives training. Um, Put no, our he's, faith in he's, in he's, he's all intelligence. <laughs> <laughs> That's his thing. Intelligence gathering. All right. Uh, in the meanwhile, uh, I'm gonna make a tech use roll. Never mind. I was trying to repair my power field because it uh, fizzled out last time. Yep, it did. You saved your ass with it, if I recall. Come to me. Let's try. Nope. All right. That's with a plus ten as well. I can Eight. make it stop working. <laughs> Wait. What? What? What are you doing? <laughs> Smack it twice. His shield what, is what, inoperable. What? What are you doing with the tech? He you needs to re reactivate his shield. We don't have a tech. Uh, power shield. Power I, shield. I am trained in tech, though. So am I. Give it a shot. Uh, plus it's a 10. minus 30 penalty to repair the power field. Oh, minus right. 30? Yeah. You guys, yeah, you guys hear giant explosions in the back. Okay. Um, Here, we gotta go. Yeah. Hang on. I have an idea. If we put a grenade with the pin primed right here and some of these charges on it. 
I was thinking we were going to say put it on, like, on my power field. There is, there is a battery bank right here for the, that, their melta cannon, so we can use that. Yeah, to, uh, that's, that's what I was saying. Yeah, we could try and block it and make a little improvised bomb. Or, or we can take the explosive that's on the front of my shield and we can put it right here. <laughs> it is a giant landmine. <laughs> Actually, let's do that. That's probably let's the same. Actually, maybe, maybe we do both. So okay. you're going to set up a For a bigger things. explosive. There's also these traps, too. Do you guys want to do anything with these things? Um, can we... We don't have a lot of time, so let's just... Yeah, we need to do fast. Yeah, I would say choose one thing and do that one thing. Yep. I can take the explosive off the front of my shield, and then you guys can either prime a grenade with these here, or you can tr put a grenade or something here. Is anybody here even trained with explosives? I'm no. trained with tech use. I'm just going to tech use the explosive off of my shield. That's fine. I mean, I'm the one who put it there, so... Like how all three of you just failed your tech. You're not. You're not right. You're not. <laughs> imagine you're not making a new explosive. You're just no. I'm literally moving it because it's it's a remote detonated. Uh, so I'm literally just pulling it from my shield and putting it right down, right. Okay. Right here. That's a what little, I'm doing. Yeah, a little bit dangerous. So minus ten. So, a little bit dangerous. I also, I also assist uh, Crown with that. Yeah, and then add your modifier, which I think assistance is what plus ten. Yeah. He's got a plus 10. I've got... I'm using my foresight. So that's a plus 20. Please fucking work. Successfully remove <laughs> the detonator <laughs> off your shield. <laughs> All right. We're putting... With your, the, with your giant hand, you just scrape it off. <laughs> We're like, putting the leaper mine right here in the middle, so it will... <laughs> there we go. We now have explosives on our... Oh. Here. We'll save, and I'm gonna do one D. That's gonna be a one D one hundred this time, and then we'll save on that. So minus that. That's a minus thirty overall. Wait, yeah, because if it was a minus ninety, I don't think I would I would ever be able to beat that. No, if it's minus ninety, then whatever your bonuses are. Your guy's fighting the urge. Oh, heavens. You're fighting the I'm urge. Say, a minus 90. I would have to have, what, 100 in my thing to beat it? Something like that. Is that how your bonus is applied and you got a negative 7.2? I have a plus 60, and you're telling me to minus 90. Minus 90 is the, is the will. Yeah, minus 90, and then we're, add your bonuses to it. So my bonuses are... I've got uh, the suit wards, which is plus 30, and then either the keeper trait or oathbound typically is the one that works against it. So oathbound is plus 30 mind control. Keeper trait is plus 30 resist. Psychic power is possession, yada, yada, yada. Add those bonuses. Uh, was that your will save with all those bonuses applied or no? Uh, if that's if that negative seven point two is your save, fifty plus to... negative thirty. Okay, plus so, five is ninety seven. You roll the ninety seven on the one d one hundred. So bad roll. So you're gonna fate point that, or you're just gonna let let it fly? I'm gonna fate point it. Okay. Because Dominagus, I got bad news for you. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> you're helping him, right? So. You're oh, going shit. into the leaper mine too. <laughs> uh, How did you know? Oh. <laughs> All right. What am I? So I'm. That'd be what minus twenty now. Yeah, you get a plus ten. Okay. You you your guy clenches his fist briefly. You get a faint vision of the future, and then. You do your a thing. Faint vision of the future. What the fuck am I seeing? Just a faint vision. You don't know. Really, oh, you can't discern I'm, it. I'm seeing what Dominego looks like as a leaper mine. <laughs> 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 Dominego, I have great news. Your future position is that of a mine. 
Well, no, <laughs> no, you you're you get a fate vision. Not not that future for him per se, but like uh, you, it, was, it looked like a different space marine altogether. And it was uh, what you what you're describing, where it strapped the guy in mind and then blew him up. All right. He oh, nearly thinks I was Dominagus. That that person was Dominagus. Yeah. <laughs> That's what you know. What, that's what I think. I think I just saw Dominagus strapped to a landmine. That's true. Yeah. Brother, I have great news. You look fantastic as a landmine. <laughs> that's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> just do logic, just to see what he meant. Did anyone booby trap that <laughs> with a grenade or anything? Are you feeling okay, Cam? Huh? Are you feeling okay? You're not feeling worse since donning that armor? Donning which armor? The Talking about quiet. Armor. <laughs> I've always worn this armor. Oh, dear. Since I Firing. was 800 oh. years ago. Your turret's hmm. acting up again. Stand by. <laughs> yes, yes. Let's, let's refocus here. You're talking about... The armor that you stepped in only a few hours ago. That armor you've been wearing for hundreds of years, you say? We've been engaged in battle for four days. What do you mean several hours ago? <laughs> so, you're on a character, are you just forgetting that you, uh, you stepped into the giant armor that's possessing you? Character Krom currently thinks he's in a different battle. Sweet. <laughs> he genuinely doesn't remember which battle he's in right now. He's lost in his thoughts. Uh, he thinks he's currently assaulting a fortress. He thinks he's fighting World Eaters and Alpha Legion. I'm going to do a... Uh... Also, see if you can perceive what year he thinks it is. <laughs> Uh, 30k. That is a good bet. You're 2001. The Space Odyssey. Let's do a quick, uh, reading willpower, or, uh, power on, on Grom. Go for it. Tora, you might want to do a dodge check here. What? That turret flipped on you. That wasn't a great one. It missed. Of course it missed. That's why it's hitting him. Oh. <laughs> I'm on the other side of the shoulder, how did it miss firing the wrong direction? I don't know. And it's on a shield in front of him. So it's literally aiming at his shoulder, shooting at you now. Oh it would God. have to aim through him to hit me. I don't think so. I'm literally on the opposite side of him from the the turret. He's on the left side, the shield's on the right. Yeah, the shield's always it would aim, It would be aiming through his head to hit me. I suppose. I suppose. Okay, well then he has to do a dodge check. He's about to get hit in the face. The standby. Wait, is it DM? What is it? Nice W. There we go. Because, yeah, the server turret was targeting something, legitly, and missed. Horribly. And then, uh, Eric Hayes, what are you doing again? Are you scanning I just, him? I was just doing a, uh, a reading check on him. There we go. I've typed. What am I doing? Cool. Dodge. Uh, so, Eric Hayes. Fuck his dodge agility? So what does your power do precisely when you're doing readings check? Just emotions? Yeah, it's the three strongest emotions. Because I didn't get high enough, so I can't actually sense if he's been more corrupt or not. Anger. There you go. Yeah, you dodge. You, you literally dodge out of the way as that gun turret lights up uh, in your general direction. How many rounds did it fire? I just... It fired, looked like two, so. 
keeping track of the magazine. Targeting something. Hey, you Can I look one? around to figure out what it was targeting? Sure. I'm aged and confused. So you you Sweet. look around. The only thing you kind of see is a giant mutated rat on the ceiling, like Spider-Man walking. Oh, I'm just gonna shoot it then. Okay, Eric, ladies, you got my uh, message. I did, yeah. Oh, okay. So you guys pushing on? Yes. Okay, traps are set, and then you hear a second explosion as they bust through the second door. All right, we'll hurry up. Also, there's, there's a door that closes it. Uh, I don't see a door, visible door. It's just an open hallway. Oh, okay. 6.9. Nice. Right, okay. guys, let's, let's keep moving. Okay, and then uh, who has the stats for that trap? Uh, it's a mine. Stand by. Let me... Actually, pull it should out. be Dan. Dan should have that C scanner thing. Yeah, I gave it to Dan. Are you waiting for the the boom or? I was just gonna move and let the, if the trap goes off, the trap goes off. Yeah, it goes off. That's why I asked. Uh, page one forty six, right? Uh, rights of battle. I will pull that up in a second. Let me pull up the rights. Yeah, of just battle. give me give me the damage details on it, and then we'll see what this thing does. Yeah, at least it'll fuck him up. The document's loading. Hang on, this laptop's a piece of shit. Craps hop detected. Uh, yeah, and you're see suspecting that next room. Okay, let me get you one second. You see a turret here. Oh, and you see the other turret, too. See him? Yep. See two turrets. I should just make a token that it gives you all visibility and just move that as needed. Yeah. I'm going to probably do that. Give me a second. And I use. We get a skull probe now. No, it's just, I'm gonna use. Oh my a... god! There's a giant wizard. <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna be your guys' sight. So, let's see. Oh, then... I have one of those. I could just send my bird out. <laughs> oh yeah, I have a familiar, right? I don't have a familiar. It's a yeah, it's a cyber familiar. Oh yeah. I forgot I had him. <laughs> oh. Okay, cool. Yeah, and I let everyone know that there's a turret on the right. There you go. You got shared vision now. You guys can see his shared vision the, of the wizard. Said so we were already doing that. Yes. But... Sweet. Yes. And I, I'll I will save that as a token, or as an actual character. Uh... Right. Well, now it allows us to see what the uh, the aspect sees and other stuff. Um. Why is this thing being? Cool, cool. As those I guys poke the around the side. corner. <laughs> because I see them, and our poor trainee is all the way at the back. You know what? Let's move him up here. He wasn't stupid to stay back there. No, he's not. Of course. Of course. So, you're, where are you moving this bird to? Oh, uh, I mean, uh, towards our path, whatever path is ahead. I see a turn on the right, so we probably want to move it to the left, yeah? Oh, you want to go left? No. Yeah. Well, I meant up the hallway, but... Okay. How far can this board go? Is as far as you want? Yeah. There's no real limit on it. But I'm also not, like, super focused on, on him. I just want him to be ahead just a bit. Yeah, so he's gonna he's gonna stay up here. I like that I use the wizard. That's pretty great. The wizard. <laughs> okay, so 
you guys can go through the turret infested area and get blasted, or you can use this corridor to the left here. One of the guardsmen points it out. Oh, where those red circles also turrets? Yes. Oh, okay. I thought oh. those were like landmines. Gotcha. All right. Oh, no, 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 me, no. me too. Okay. I no. thought there was just the one turret in the rest were mines. Okay. No, no, no. Red turrets. Red is. Gotcha. Red. Uh, red, those, those red circles. All turrets in there. There's four turrets in that room. All, all out of kind of. Cannon and some other variants you're not oh. sure of. <laughs> okay, can... cool. Then I'll call him back and we'll go the other way. Also, uh... it's got a 10 meter range. Oh, it does? No, the mine. <laughs> oh, the mine. Okay. Yeah. Nice. The Yeah. In uh, <laughs> 10 meter uh, range. I'm trying to pull up the actual like, stats though because this table's fucked. All right. Let's go through this side door. Hurry. They're literally right there. Uh, it's supposed to be well, a leaper mine specifically. Well, but... They're dealing with the explosion right now, so... Okay. okay. That's what I said. They're literally right there. Hurry. Let's go. I'm not... Oh, yeah. I'm not paying attention because I'm looking at something else trying to... Yeah. Because one of the books I had had it. This one that I have is all... It's on my other computer. This one, it's like all canted and cockamamie, and so Are I can't... You, like, question. Did you use some of those meta, uh, melted cannon ammunition as well? Yes. Just Okay, so I'm just gonna do this to them. A melta bomb is sixty ten <laughs> to seven with fifteen ten. So <laughs> I was so one, two, three, four, five. How many play placing down? There was twenty charges. I just grabbed a handful. Okay, you just grabbed a handful. Did you guys put all twenty down? Uh, and the, or, did, 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 or did Dominguez take some? I think Dominguez take what took. I don't know how many he took. The what? How There's, many of the ammo, the melt ammo, did you take? Did you just grab one? I didn't or grab multiple. I didn't really take any of the batteries because I couldn't didn't trust this. It's chaos. Okay. okay. Then yeah, he didn't take any one, of them. One, so. two, three, four, five, six, seven. So you can use all twenty then. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Would 15, that just be a melt bomb? 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. So let me get the damage totals up. Because uh, it might have wiped out that entire group, plus the Dreadnought. I'm pretty sure it just wiped out that entire hallway. Yeah, because this is what a melt up bomb does. Which, when you shoot the round versus when you detonate it. <laughs> right. That's just, I'm going to calculate down. I'll, I'll probably just damage everyone in that corridor with this. A 60, because it might survive. Remember, that, if it's a melta, that's right. It's also incinerating um, the armor as it's melting. That's true. You're right. So the first hundred is going to be used to destroy the guy's armor, and the rest goes straight to the the damn guys. So if it's over a certain amount, seventies for the armor because he already took damage. Oh, for one of them. There's yeah, two. the first guy. Yeah. 60, 54. I'm at uh, 1,015 damage so far. Uh, that is 1,134 damage. Yeah, they're just all dead. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, every single one just died in that hallway. Jesus Christ. And there actually is no hallway left. It is a... <laughs> And that's what was on my shield. <laughs> yeah, it's just not as bad. But... Yeah, it's a molten hellscape now. So I have great news, guys. We can't go back that way. Yeah, molten hellscape. So. I think that's a good idea. And how is that great news? They can't come from that way. Ah, okay, They're that's great news. You literally killed. You literally <laughs> killed the ambushers. We ambushed the ambushers. I was like a thousand damage. Yeah, they're 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 freaking dead. They have five hundred armor, <laughs> or not five hundred. They have five hundred health plus hundred armor. That's six hundred. So they 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 wouldn't survive that. It'd just be boop dead. How many people was that? Oh, uh, two dreadnoughts and about eight eight chaos space marines. Okay, stand by. <laughs> I need to do something for non-specific reasons. Personal. Uh, eight. But, but tactically, you guys know that's probably an alert every single guy. 
to your guys' location, that big, big acid explosion. So, yeah, to the other you, side of the explosion. You guys are on the. If you guys look at where you're at, you're behind their lines now. Yeah, they're going to be going to the front of their lines looking for a big ass explosion. It'll be fine. That's, that's true. Yeah, see, we made a distraction within the distraction. Hey. <sighs> Oh, I was so hoping to hit you that dreadnought, yo mug. I didn't know you had that uh, freeze. Like, well, that sucks. You'd you'd had a nice just nice, got it. You'd had a nice auto cannon up the butt, but I, like, I don't I don't want that up the butt. <laughs> Sorry. You, uh, now that I'm not having my uh, in character uh, crisis, what the fuck is going on in character? Uh, oh, it exploded. worked. Yep. And the bird's flying. Have you ordered the bird to come back yet? Because it's just like... Yeah, I, said, I told it to come back. Okay, cool. You have a bird? Yeah. Yes, I have two, wizard. in fact. Well, the I wizard... Forgot I had it. The wizard's <laughs> the shared vision. It's not... But we use him as the bird token as well, because it's shared vision. So when you use the Auspex, we'll use the wizard to see ahead instead of moving your token. I like it. So we have a bird now. You've had a bird, apparently. <laughs> we've, we've had it. I just forgot that I have him. So what, what are we doing? We're going through the story over here. This one? No, this one. There's four auto cannons in that direction, he tells you. Oh, very well. I don't yeah, want It's to... a hallway of death. We're moving this way. <laughs> See, here's the thing. Yeah, so if that hallway exploded and this hallway is full of turrets, they're going to think that we came from the other way and they're going to go around the other way. Right. It's perfect. It's like I planned this. I did not yes. plan. So, Car Karnoff, you go there, you see a giant pipeway. I see black. I see blackness. We can go you around. Know, step down here. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Oh. Let's see. Yeah, so... Oh, there's physically a doorway that I couldn't see through. I, I no, couldn't see yeah. Guard, guardsman opened it for you. He's like, let me help you. Do I fit? <laughs> Do I fit through the doorway? Barely. You so if you move five. underneath the door, there should be space. Hang on here. I got the idea. Crab walk. Crab walk. Oh, crab. hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now we'll turn back. And then I'll grab Brasoras, make sure I didn't, like, scrape their, them while I walk through. <laughs> okay. What's that? Miraculously, he fits through the door. You just hear a scraping as my pauldron, like, breaks part of the wall. <laughs> yeah. There's a door there the guardsman points out. Are we going this way, or are we going this way? So that way, you see there's a pipeway. Um, it looks like there's a way in, into that pipe. At least it's somewhere. Uh, down here? Yeah. You're, you can go that way if you want. Uh, you know what? Pipes have never led us astray before. Don't you have a bird thing? Uh, shouldn't we ask the, the rebels which way we should go? Their leader's dead. They don't know. Okay, they don't know. Okay. They don't know. Do they know? The leader's Deploy the bird. <laughs> Do they know the general direction? Um, yes, they point you the general it. direction. It's, it's due west down the main corridor. So the bird is getting pushed where? Uh, we'll send him down the pipeway a bit. Just we to have see to go pipe. that way. No. So, ammunition room. It's, you see more ammunition. You see... Corn suits of art. It looks like a staging area of some sort. Birds discovering. But otherwise devoid of people. I'm zooming you don't, it doesn't, yeah, it doesn't detect anyone or see anything. It looks like another weapons cache. Alright, I think we'll go this way, which is very much around what they expect us. We go through the pipe. Oh, one moment, please. Hold on. Wait, what does the bird see up here? Did the bird already go all the way up there? He went to the west, down the pipe, which is down this way. 
You're seeing this way? Em empty corridor? Well, it's detecting more of those turrets. Oh, that's what those... It's the same uh, hallway. So there are no turrets. Multiple turrets. Those it's the same hallway as the uh, one we those, decided to avoid. Are those torches turrets? That is literally oh, the exact same hallway. Yeah. No, we have to avoid this one on the right. Which goes but, up and over to those turrets. Okay, so this yeah, way so... is bad. Yes, that way is bad. We want to go the other way. Okay. Perhaps it is. So we're navigating our way through these beautiful, beautiful pipes. Your guys will, are gonna have to crawl through. It's yes, a pretty I narrow go, pathway. I will go like second to last just in case I get stuck. I, I think crawl might might actually get stuck if we are crawling. I don't think he can go through. He just has to be careful. Uh, yeah. True. Do an agility check. Get get through or climb. Because your guys literally is gonna want to. Uh, Karen, Crom, uh, yeah, Crom. Uh, Crom's guy's gonna do. I'm he's gonna be. Sure. He's literally pulling himself through. So it's either a climb or. I used it agility. You, you, said you get there. Through, yeah, just one agility check. You guys gonna hoop, hoop, get through. Uh, yeah, the trainee's getting through. Already went through. So then you got through, just fine. A little worse for wear, but you got through. The armor now has some scrapes on it. <laughs> Traded some paint. All right. So you see, see a giant weapons cache. You see corn armor everywhere. And we'll save on Chrom as he sees all this. Just a regular will save? Minus 60. So plus zero. I made it. Good. All right. He is scanning for traps. No traps. Yeah, do we? All right. So side looks clear. You see more melted ammunition. And can I close this door right here? Anything for small arms? Yes. I'm closing this door. You click the door, nothing happens. It looks very um, Sweet. old, old, decrepit, and it looks like they took the doors out again. <laughs> very well. What about this one here? Did they take I'm the noticing a recurring theme. Yeah. <laughs> you want to seal the door. <laughs> They're just ripping. They're ripping all the doors out. It looks like the doors. Real fake paneling doors. Ripped out. Yeah, you see paneling ripped out. It looks like they were just taking things, like like ransacking and looting the area. And you see uh, corn effig effigies everywhere. Symbolism. You see uh, people strung up on the walls. All sorts of things. All the goodies. That's normal. I pass by one of the effigies and I just knock it down. That might be a bad idea. Nothing happens. Never mind. All right. Look for a way out. Okay. Oh, uh, Cyberbird? Yeah. Oh, it's one Cyberbird. So Cyberbird goes over here. There is a doorway that goes this way. It finds. Oh, okay. Excellent. Which way? Here, I'll, I'll pop okay. you through the other side. Are you going to all specs it first? Probably a good idea. Nah, let's just chase, uh, face check this bush. It'll be fine. Okay. There totally won't be a demon hiding behind it. No. Yep. You don't, it's not picking up anything. No motion. In fact, it reports back. It's uh, hearing a lot of explosions and sounds like up that elevator shaft. Well, there was a war happening up top, so that makes sense. <laughs> a war that we caused. <laughs> well, it'll buff. Continued. So you guys have 
about two hours left. Right, we move through. Is that with the half hour that we uh, blocked off? We're excluding the hour, half hour that we blocked off. Excluding. Okay. Uh, am I having to agility my ass through this again? Never no, it's just a normal doorway. Okay. Large enough for you to get through. Don't forget our goofballs down south. I won't. You guys want to call it here for the big battle, or you guys want to push on? It's only 11. I can go for it in like a, few, yeah. a couple more hours, I think. Well, I got fighter practice today, so that's why I asked. So. Uh, okay. Oh, well, if you got to go, then go. How long until yeah. you go? Uh, 1230 could probably vamoose. I, I no, gotta go to no the harbor. Yeah, so I gotta go to the harbor store and get uh, brass rivets and rivet on my strap for my helm. So can uh, we do a big battle in an hour and a half? That's the question. Yeah. Doubt it. Get like partly through. We can probably get let's, halfway let's, through, I think. Let's take a break. Uh, I'm tired. I'm tired. Uh, tired. Uh, sure, uh -huh. sure. So... 3,000 experience. 3K. Okay. Yes. That was a good All fight right. anyway. You guys didn't get to actually fight him straight up. Well, you almost got melted by that cannon, though. I mean, yeah, that I cannon... Have... That cannon was stupid. Like, minus 60 <laughs> to hit it. <laughs> yes. And yet Jesus we somehow it. got it. I have... Well, ranks. that hidden cannon ranks. was kind of me. Yeah. You got two ranks and what? I have two ranks currently of unspent XP. Yeah, right? I got 12k <laughs> unspent. Yeah. Well, I geez. have... I have oh, so we're going to be at max rank by the end of this. I have 24k unspent. Oh my god. Why? Right. Because I'm XP on a new character. How much XP did I get last time? I don't know. I just keep, uh, I keep stacking it up. I need to, um... Yeah, well, it makes, spend yeah, it makes it. sense for your character. I have 41,000. That nice. is true. Boko is correct. After this, you'll be a near veteran, because the next mission is going to be uh, pretty hard. This is like a side quest mission. So. Yep. I thought this was like the super duper difficult optional side quest that we decide to do anyway. I didn't yes. realize that the next mission is going to be even harder. <laughs> yeah, way harder. Well, yeah, we're going to be well, like Broco's learning our weaknesses right now. Oh, He's yeah, gonna true. He's going to exploit them later. That's right. I'll be a legend tier psyker by then, so. Yeah. Ooh. I will be an even older keeper. <laughs> well, you guys I'll, have been at... I will have a psychic rating of 14. Jeez. Oof. Is that good? God damn. And so well, you know, max is at 10, yes. Oh. <laughs> yes. So you're, you're good a legend. Yeah, is, is it 10 emperor level? So, what? No, if you go off of, like, you know, the normal psychic things, yeah, but this system uses a different oh, okay. rating system than the actual in-game lore. You're more powerful than the Emperor in Psyker level. That's no, it's, it's different. <laughs> <laughs> like, no, what would like even... 20 or something. What would even be more powerful than the Emperor? Mm -hmm. Like, one of the Chaos Gods or some shit? Currently, yep. yes. The Uninjured Emperor? Or yeah, even yeah, some uh, Xenos entities. <laughs> With his sword. Like the Cacophonus? Uh, Probably. Before I got murdered by the... Uh, Black Templars. So it's not more powerful than Emperor. Got murdered. No, but it did kill thousands of sorcerers in it, like across the galaxy when it died. <laughs> nice. When it died. Holy <laughs> their shit. Heads up. And it's also the reason why, at least supposedly the reason why the Black Templars don't have psychers, is because it killed all of their psychers, and they've no longer been able to have psychers in their chapter. What the fuck? Since. Oh. Oh, because their gene seed was touched by the uh, psychic blacklash. Yep. I touched Remember. your gene seed. Basically. Uh -huh. Ugh. Hang on, so is this big <laughs> Never battle say that like, again. really about to occur? <laughs> 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 so there's two, there's two uh. knights, two knight ten titans guarding the courtyard. <laughs> okay. You know of. Vortex uh. grenades on their legs. Then they can't right. stand up. I'm going to hand off a vortex grenade 
to one of our fast boys. Guy, All you, you know, gotta guy, do. Guy with a jump pack. <laughs> All you gotta do is yeet it on the knight's leg, and it can't stand. No, what you do? We have to get it to them, and I'm slow as fuck. So I need someone with a jetpack, the jetpack to arrange they can toss it on their leg. What you oh, do boy. is you give it to a guardsman, and then you tell the guardsman to run at the enemy. You trust the guardsman <laughs> or the better. Name that or That's or an better. important task. You give it to the guardsman, then use the guardsman as a football to throw it at the end. <laughs> no, no, no. no, you give it to the cybird. <laughs> oh, there you I don't go. Kill no, the cybird. You can get a new one. Oh, come on. You're going to eat the bird? Actually, no, the bird's going to eat itself. <laughs> oh, God. Hello, Akbar. Wizard. <laughs> Does anybody have two bags of holding and a familiar, real quick? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, just cast all of your fireballs every night into a bag of holding. <laughs> <laughs> and then at the end of it, just hold it towards the the opening towards the enemy and open it. Yeah, and uh, <laughs> you know, like the commander reports back that uh, they're they're winning the battle. They got the corn held up in their fortifications. They're not gonna be able to hold forever though, because they they've detected uh, corn reinforcements. Weren't they supposed to be starting to retreat? Yes. Okay. So the ones that are retreating have started to retreat. Yes. Okay. But there's also resistance. To those about to die, we salute you. Right. And there's other ones holding the line so the others can retreat. So they can't okay. just That's retreat without getting wiped out. For those about to rock and stone, we salute you. No, no, no. For those about to die, we salute you. All right. So the plan is vortex grenade on the uh, nice legs. Yes. Of course. Excellent. Because that's the yeah. actual reason I brought the damn things. <laughs> Uh, I think, yeah, I think I should be taking it, and I can also increase my movement speed even further by using one of my solo mode abilities. So you have so, one, two, or three grenades. How many did I give you? I should be pretty... You like, I think I'm going to get up to, like, yeah. 200. Three, but I used one of them, so we have two yeah. left. That's not no, including we... the one that straps to your chest. Yeah, about to say, we have three, you just can't get one of them unless I take my helmet off. And I'm not doing that. You don't get to see my beautiful face. <laughs> That's a good session. Yeah. All right. So the next session, we're eating uh, Azora at the uh, nights. So the, what's the plan? What's the plan once you get to your psycher, psycher guys? GTFO. Yeah. Oh, we we yeah. need to cast uh, the explosive device as well. The the relic. Yeah, if, it's, if it's like on the way, yeah. Um, well, we'll probably have to, after we get our Psyker guys, uh, what I saw in the Intel thing is that, uh, the, the beams are, the poles of, uh, anti-Psyker nonsense are around the edges, up mm -hmm. top. Yep. So we either go further back underneath ground where my Psyker powers seem to work, or, um, we have to raid the ramparts and destroy enough of those things that I can actually use my power to get us out of here. Which so, I do. That's the other reason I'd said, just in case, we, ha we had a dropship. You so, still have a dropship. Just nothing yeah. we're going to use. I'm not, not trying to, I'm not trying to give Boko any ideas here, but... Then don't say it out loud. What <laughs> if the psychers so that we're trying to rescue turn out to be corrupted, and we have to fight them, and they're the final boss? <laughs> Well, you realize, I mean, they're very well could, yeah. but it's better they die then than yeah. be used as a weapon for the uh, <laughs> yeah, the true. Community. But true. Listen, you realize they're going to have to be a, uh, briefed anyways. Right? Do you want to do like a no lore check or something? No, like <laughs> no. Right. Let's no, not I mean, they, make I that a thing. This, you're, you're on the nose, but you're not fighting these guys. But you're on the nose of uh, uh oh, warp demon. Right. So. You, you then they're done that. Why they're not dead? <laughs> yeah, we killed the warp demon already earlier. <laughs> right. Because <laughs> you know, uh, Yelmug, your character would know that they would, corn would just outright kill these psychers. But there's a yep. reason they're not killing them for some reason. Mm. So if you want to try to deduce that as you're down here, you could. 
I mean, your best, your best guess if you have like Xenos or not Xenos Lord, uh, Chaos Floor or something I, like that. Oh, oh, actually, actually, I have, I have I've demonology. Got philosophy. Will that help? Hang on. You said you need what lore? I got uh, demonology lore. lore. Uh, you uh, said you need heresy. You know what? I have uh, unspent uh, fate points. Let's uh, let's uh, burn some uh, of that. Do it again. Here, let me. Uh, <laughs> Bam! One point. Hey, seven. there it is. So, as go. far as you know, you How long have you rolled for? for? It's yeah, the you, same oh. check. You may have heard of an instance of this happening. Uh, it's some book you read uh, that it's probably a demon prince or some kind of higher entity. They, they, they don't want to outright free them because it might be a, considered a betrayal. But at the same time, so they're trying to figure out a way to get this guy released and kill the psyker. So that's your best guess. Is that there's a reason, like it might be seen as a betrayal, and they don't want to. That's so why they're... corn is summon. So these followers of corn, what you're telling me is that they're trying to summon a keeper of secrets. Like so they're trying to summon the chaos version of me. Um. So they're, yeah, they don't. That's why they haven't not right probably killed them. It's because they don't want to betray the entity. Oh, then I could just walk up and pretend to be the entity and everything will be fine. It's trapped in those psychers. They're, um, because they captured it. As far, so that's best guess on the mission they were sent on is to capture something of this nature and then contain it. What are the odds I could bullshit my way into making them think that I'm it? Probably zero. Okay. Because it's trapped in those guys. So his, it's time his, for a real fancy pyrotechnics display. Yeah, his uh somebody gets a smoke machine. Yeah, so so <laughs> Heracletes has deduced that more than likely they're not the uh, the psychers themselves are doing it on on purpose to seal that thing. So it's not like they were forced to capture this thing or they just possess them. It's more <laughs> like they're sent a mission to capture this thing. In any case, that's a next time problem. Yes. What I'm hearing is exterminatus. Sure. Always exterminatus. <laughs> next time on Death. Death Watch Z. All right. Then see you next week. All right. See you all see next week. See you. See you. Choose.